What's up guys, my name is Tab and you are watching Mr. Shortai. Hope you guys are all well. Today I'm gonna give you a different <coughs> video today guys. Um sick and tired of those COVID videos. I thought, you know what, it's getting me depressed. Why not? Let's make something different. So before I get into it, I just want to say if you guys are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. And don't forget to give it a giant thumbs up to you guys and share this with your family and friends. And I will see you in the next shot. So literally, I've got some images that I'm going to be showing you guys. And it's all about online shopping fails. And, you know, the disappointment that you get that when you receive items from the internet. But... It's all just a place on sh online shopping in a nutshell, guys. What we sometimes, what we expect is what we don't get. So, they're starting off with the first image here. We have a pair of Nike trainers. Oh. I remember these the ladies' boots that came out from, I don't know what brand it was, but the Kardashian, the Kardashians wore them. And... Uh, to be honest with you, I don't, you'll never see me get my bare feet out in those. I don't want to be seeing my bare, look at that. Look at the ugly feet on those. Why would you want to wear something like this? Horrible. Yes. Expectation versus reality. Definitely not. Definitely not me. That's definitely a fail for me. And plus it all steams up and you can see all that condensation inside. No way, no way you'll see me dead in these guys, no way. <laughs> Next we have is uh, Rick, Rick from Rick and Morty. Wow guys, imagine ordering something for your friend, a dollar line, and you get something else. <laughs> it seems like he's got two pairs of eyes, he's got eyes that sit underneath another set of eyes, so but, um, definitely... Wow, seems like it's got a big chest and massive arms as well, look. <laughs> oh, mate. That's the reality, you've got to be careful of what you order, you know. Even though what the image shows is not always what you get. Don't know what the hell is that coming out of his mouth. Everything's just been stitched wrong. <laughs> Uh, imagine that friend who gets this. Hmm. That's definitely going back for me. Better as we go along through these images. Next we have is a Deadpool. <laughs> wow. You know, you, you think you've ordered you think you've ordered the right suit, but in reality you're getting something totally different, which looks like a more like a Teletubby suit. Wow. I think it'll take Five of me to get into them. Well, wow, look at it. How could people get away with this? You know, you you kind of ad advertising something that's similar to what a Deadpool is, which is which isn't too bad. And then then you're getting this crap here on your right. How could they get away with this? Definitely won't be keeping that. Look at it. It's nowhere near, nowhere near Deadpool. That is. Wow. crazy how people just think that it's okay to rip off people like this. Wow. Amazing. Let's go with the next image. Oh, we have a little pussycat here. Oh, look at that disappointment on the cat's face. And uh, you've ordered him a, a cat scratching pool the next minute. Wow. <laughs> Probably the, Probably it's the size of its paw, probably just knock it over. <laughs> well, you guys remember, put a note to yourself that whenever you're buying something online, especially Amazon, always check the dimensions of when you're buying something. I'm telling you, you're never going to get what you've ordered. It's always going to be too big or too small. Oh, it's not going to be in the right colour or the right size. <laughs> oh, you can see the disappointment on the cat's face as well. Oh, that's a shame. 
I'm sure the cat was looking forward to that, and so the householder as well, so doesn't scratch the living daylights out of the sofas and everything. Well, hmm, feels sorry. Let's go with the next image. We have a, a glass of wine, a, a onion, <laughs> and then a small pan. Wow, I don't even think that onion could fit into that pan, even though I'm that half cut onion. Look at it. Why is that made for a dollhouse? Damn. This is why it's really important, guys. Always check your dimensions when ordering online. Damn. Imagine that. It's Christmas and you're cooking for your family. And this pan arrives. <laughs> well, you definitely won't be feeding all them people in that pan. Or yourself. Crazy. So the next image. Oh, and you thought you were buying a nice dress for a good night out. Hey, so we can we can say this is a, what is it? A dress versus a dressing that could cover a wound. <laughs> wow, look at it. Damn. Oh, mate. Online versus reality. I'm, I'm sure uh, you get a lot of these from uh, online online shops like um, is it Boohoo and all along those fast fashion lines where you order something and it's <laughs> and it's either come too small or or too big. Uh, I'm, I'm sure I'm sure you get a lot of these. Uh, I've seen them as well, so um, but this is kind of the best one that I could get. You know, look at it, look at it, look how different it is as well. How could you get away with that? Well, there, there goes your night out then. Unfortunately, eating in with your small pan. I had to leave this to the last because this actually made me laugh, and the reason why because it reminds me of uh, of a watch that my that my son bought back when he went to Pakistan. Um, his cousin got him and it was very similar to this <laughs> and uh, yeah so the actual face of the watch was really really m massive and big and uh, it was just like you can tell it was literally fake I mean you could tell it's fake anyway but you know it's just hilarious to see people making these and people people are actually buying them Crazy, imagine a friend of yours bought you that for $600 off eBay and uh, and you open your prezzies and you have that. What would you guys think? Damn, they even called it iWatch as well. Well, and then on the, <laughs> and on the, on the watch they wrote iPhone watch. Wow. So how the hell are you supposed to connect it? Are we not supposed to be living in the digital era? Where is the digital watch? Well, at least they've got the Apple logo in the right shape, aren't they? They were messed up with that. I don't know, guys. It's crazy stuff. So, what I'm going to say is, whenever you're buying something on the internet, always be careful of what you buy. Always read the, di uh, the dimensions and the spec, um, um, especially on Amazon and eBay, because you get a lot of fakes. If something is too good to be true, and it's saying it's cheap as chips and please 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 ignore it move on to something else and then um or buy the original be careful be careful because internet is full of fake fake stuff and uh you don't want to be paying at at three nose for something that doesn't resemble the actual product so be careful of what you buy online guys um so yeah like I said, if it's too good to be true, don't buy it. You know, um, I'm sure we've been tempted to buy iPhones and, and these Apple Watches, and you get a lot of um, fake fake stuff from the from the Asian continent side. So be careful, because a lot of people are selling fakes, and unfortunately, some people do get away with it, and you don't get returns. And you're going to be struggling to get your money back as well. So be careful, guys. 
and uh, I hope that made you laugh as well. Um, if it hasn't, then I'm sorry, but if it has, then thumbs up, guys. Uh, but uh, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, thought it would make a difference from not making a, a video about my isolation day, which is actually day four today, so I didn't want to go into that show you what I'm eating because that's what it was all about wasn't it just me eating eating so yeah so I thought I'd make something different so that's all for me today and uh, I don't think I'll be probably making a video tomorrow I think daily videos are hard um, coming up coming up with things and seeing what we're gonna we're gonna make a video about which is a little bit difficult so here's the reason I'm gonna I might take a little break so by saying that thank you for watching if you guys are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe don't forget to hit the notification bell and don't forget to give it a giant like and please get your family and friends to subscribe to my channel and share this with everyone as well and you have been watching Mr. Shortai and my name is Tab. Thank you guys and I will see you on the next video. Bye.